Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So guys, in the previous video, I told you that I am I'm just uploading 8 mocks and 4 mocks in one video itself, but it took a lot time that's why i'm just making uh, this separate video for four mocks questions okay if you didn't watch that eight mocks most important questions please go and watch that one also and then come to this video and mark this four, four mocks questions as well okay guys so without wasting any time let's get into the video i hope guys you all have wrote uh, you all have written your english exam well okay i know that most of the students may go wrong in grammar please try to do uh, more exercises on grammar in english language i'm telling you okay if you do more and more practice then it will be easy for you it will be a piece of cake for you uh, for your uh, public exam okay so do practice well guys still you have three months time for your main public exam so means if you study from today itself means from now itself from this month okay it is more more chances to get f more than 550 marks also okay if you are slow learner who are watching this video please go through uh, the questions whatever i am discussing here in this video okay uh, uh, i'll try to upload the most important questions and the little questions for you keeping in mind okay i know that most of the students who are very poor in studies okay it's okay guys let it be but i'm just keeping you in my mind and framing the questions okay so if you are a more than average student please go through all this all the uh, questions whatever given you for your syllabus then come to this video and do all the questions okay it will be a revision for you okay okay guys let's start so let's see uh, four marks question so from first chapter real numbers uh, we are there's a chance of getting only eight marks questions two marks question and one marks also but no four marks question so four marks question important chapters are polynomials then quadratic equation after that uh, arithmetic progressions then introduction to trigonometry then statistics and then probability okay so from this chapter itself we are go there is a chance of getting four mocks questions okay let's see each and every chapter uh, so guys please mark all the questions in your textbook you must uh, mark this in your textbook because it's very important and please mark it in your class notes also whenever you just uh, go through or uh, you just make a revision at that time it's very easy for you because you have already marked it in your class notes okay that's it okay let's start guys so from polynomials the first most important question is find the zeros of the polynomial x minus x square minus 3 and verify the relationship between the zeros and the coefficients okay here we have given um, the zeros of polynomials x square minus 3 so we have to find out verify the relationship between the zeros and the quotient okay very very important okay next question is answer the following question by observing the graph here one graph will be given for you guys so by observing the graph you need to cover you need to answer the given questions here i am giving you four questions so sometimes they will ask you to name the shape of the graph so what is the shape of the graph so you have to write it down parabola like that okay so next the second question will be how many zeros are there for this shape so you have to observe how many zeros okay i know that uh, you all have understood this chapter well okay if you don't have the notes for this chapter please go and visit my channel okay on my channel uh, there is a separate notes for each and every chapter okay i have explained you first to four chapters also i have explained you by myself okay that video is also there and the chapters ready-made chapter ready-made uh, solved questions means textbook questions and the exercise problems are also there separately separately okay go and visit and please write it down the notes okay got it guys okay next third question will be sum of zeros of polynomials is here sum of zeros whatever it is you have to write it down then product of zeros got it so these two are the very most important questions if you are a viewer 
means if you are a slow learner guys please whatever i am discussing go through each and every question and more than average students you have to go through the rest of the questions from your textbook and the exercise as well okay so this is the last minute preparation that's why i'm just picking the most important questions and giving you in, in this video okay got it okay don't depend on this uh, questions itself for i'm i'm just uh, i'm just telling you i'm just telling for more than average student okay so you just go beyond these questions as well okay so next so next chapter is quadratic equation so from this chapter first question is find the roots of quadratic equation 2x square plus x minus 6 equal to 0 by factorization method very important sometimes the equation will be changed but the question is same as it is got it okay let's move on to the second question which is find two consecutive positive integers sum of whose square is 365 okay next third question is the altitude of a right triangle is 7 cm less than its base if the hypothesis is 13 centimeters find the other two sides okay go through this question okay next we we'll move to the fourth question from this chapter itself so fourth question is find the two numbers whose sum is 27 and the product is 182 okay now we'll move to the next chapter that is arithmetic progression so let's see here first question is if the sum of first 24 terms of the list of numbers whose nth term is given by a n is equal to 3 plus 2 n very very important question okay next second question is find the 20th term from the last term of the ap which is 3 comma 8 comma 13 and go and so on to 3 253 understood guys okay next third question which is very important so if the sum of first 14 terms of an ap is 1050 and its first term is 10 you have to find the 20th term okay you have to find the 20th term very important next fourth question is determine the arithmetic progression ap whose third term is 5 and the seventh term is 9 so very very important got it guys these four are the questions for four marks from this arithmetic chapter got it okay let's move on to the next chapter that is introduction to trigonometry okay guys so let's see first question is so here in this chapter so from this chapter i'm giving you only three questions itself okay so prove that so first question is this okay so this is the second question and this is the third question okay you have to prove that sine theta minus cos theta plus 1 divided by sine theta plus cos theta minus 1 equal to 1 by secant theta minus tan theta you have to prove that okay very important question okay next important question is sine a plus cosecant a whole square plus cos a plus secant a whole square is equal to 7 plus tan square a plus cot square a got it guys next third important question is 1 plus secant a divided by secant a is equal to sin square a divided by 1 minus cos a okay these three are the questions from introduction to trigonometry okay so from this three definitely one will come inshallah okay next we'll move to the next chapter that is statistics okay i already told you while i am giving uh, while i was giving you the eight marks questions in that i have told you please go through go through all the three formulas that is mean median and mode okay from this chapter definitely they will ask you for two marks question four marks question 
एट मार्क्स क्वेश्चन एंड एट द सेम टाइम समटाइम्स दे विल आस्क यू वन टू टू और मोर देन टू फॉर वन मार्क्स क्वेश्चन एज वेल ओके सो गाइज दिस चैप्टर इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू कवर ऑल दिस एट मार्क्स फोर मार्क्स टू मार्क्स एंड वन मार्क्स ओके सो लेट सी टॉप टू क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम स्टैटिस्टिक इज राइट द फॉर्मूला राइट द फॉर्मूला टू फाइंड द मीडियन ऑफ द ग्रुप डेटा एंड एक्सप्लेन इट्स टर्म्स ओके सेकेंड क्वेश्चन विल बी राइट थ्री फॉर्मूले सो इफ देर इज वन फॉर्मूला विल कॉल इट एज फॉर्मूला फॉर्मूले इज द प्लूरल फॉर्म ऑफ द फॉर्मूला ओके ओके लेट इट बी गाइज सो राइट थ्री फॉर्मूले फॉर मेन फॉर ग्रुप डेटा ओके यू हैव टू राइट डाउन द थ्री फॉर्मूले फॉर ग्रुप डेटा ओके लेट्स मोन टू द लास्ट चैप्टर दैट इज प्रॉबिलिटी हियर आई एम गिविंग यू थ्री क्वेश्चन ओके सो लेट्स सी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट गाइज अ पिग्गी बैंक कंटेन्स हंड्रेड फिफ्टी पाइस कॉइन्स फिफ्टी टू रुपीज अ पिग्गी बैंक कंटेन हंड्रेड फिफ्टी पाइस कॉइन्स फिफ्टी वन रुपी कॉइन्स टेन फाइव रुपी कॉइन्स ओके दिस इज द रुपी सिंबल गाइज डोंट गेट कन्फ्यूज ओके इफ इट इज इक्वली लाइकली दैट वन ऑफ द कॉइन्स विल फॉल आउट वेन द पिग्गी बैंक इज टर्न अपसाइड डाउन ओके इफ द पिग्गी बैंक इज टर्न अपसाइड डाउन सो देर इज अ चांस ऑफ गेटिंग सम कॉइन्स वॉट आर डिस्कसिंग यर ओके सो देन वॉट इज द प्रॉबिलिटी दैट द कॉइन सो हियर इन दिस टू सब क्वेश्चन आर गिवेन What is the probability that the coin will be fifty pi fifty pies coin, and the second will be will not be rupees five coin? Got it? Okay, this is the question. Now we'll move to the next second question. In second question, there are two sub questions. Okay, let's see each. So first one will be a lot of twenty bulbs containing four de defective ones. Okay. From twenty bulbs, four defective ones are there. Okay, so one bulb is drawn at random from the from the lot. What is the probability of that this bulb is defective? This is the question. And this next question is: Suppose the bulb drawn is is first question is not defective and is is not replaced. Now. One bulb is drawn at random from the rest. What is the probability that this bulb is not defective? Okay, guys. So this up to here we have completed our four mocks important questions from each and every chapter. Okay, please. So please do prepare well, guys. Okay, inshallah, from these questions itself, you will get to see the questions in your main um, SM and exam paper. Okay, guys, thank you so much. Okay, guys, I hope this video is very helpful for you. So please don't forget to hit the like button. If you are new to my channel, then do subscribe. Please share the video to your friends also, so that they may also learn and practice the questions. Okay, and I'll upload the model paper also. I'll upload two model papers in one video itself. Please go through that one also. Inshallah, I'll try to upload soon. Okay guys thank you once again bye bye take care all the very best for your exam